Hey everybody, Anne here, just sitting here having my coffee with all you lovely folks. Well, something was delivered yesterday. Remember when I ordered that cap and spigot for the other IBC tote? Well, it was delivered yesterday and, well, I'll tell you that I returned the other one. Um, Amazon refunded my money because it is shipped by Amazon, but the seller... Um, the person that it's made by um, is different. So Amazon just had to give me my money back. They got their parts back. But then, Bevelu, I think that's how you say it. I'll show you their logo in a minute here. Um, they reached out to me and wanted to know what happened. So I told them that it came without the, um, you know, the adapter, the cap part. And uh, they said, we're going to send you another one. And I explained that I had already had my money refunded. But they sent me one anyhow at no extra price and it came so let's unbox it all right let's see it's packed pretty well much better than the other one that was just thrown in a bag with some other stuff i had ordered so let's open this i don't know what this cap is for but i don't think i need it and here's the cap it feels pretty solid it's got a like a little gasket thing down there in the middle some sealing tape. Awesome. A measuring tape. I can use one of those. And the spigot. Hooray! There it all is. Yeah, I don't think I need yeah, I don't think I need this part either, but look it. It's got a um, rubber gasket down there in the middle and a filter down in the middle. And this comes apart like this. All feels very solid. Um, the little graduated tip there is so you can put a tube on it. See that? Pretty cool. Well, there's nothing left to do but go out there and see if it fits. Okay, folks, I've just got this tote turned over on its side. So let's see. Oh, yeah. It fits. I just need to get it screwed on right. Oh, my gosh, it fits. It's perfect. Look at that. It is perfect. And it's a nice, thick cap. It's not like the one that's on the other tote that's kind of like half this size. This looks pretty gosh darn durable. Alrighty, let's get this thing in. And I've removed the pieces off of this because I'm going to attach a standard water hose to it. So I really didn't need the other parts. Okay. Let's get this on here, you guys. Oh, yeah. Everything is working great. And you know what? I didn't put... Let me show you. I, I have not put the sealing tape on the end of this. Um, I may end up doing that. I don't know if I need to. Um, so let's just get this. I'm going to just try it without first. It's perfect like a glove. Oh yeah. <laughs> Let me just get this real tight. I think that's it folks. That's all nice and tight. I wish I had some water to put in here but I don't. This turns absolutely perfectly. That's off. That's on. This is great. Thank you so much Bevelu for straightening this out for me. I have to be able to capture tons of water in these big totes. Got another one over there for survival because I don't have I don't have a well, I don't have plumbing or any of that kind of stuff. So looks like what I gotta do today is get this up on pallets and get the water catchment system set up. Put it up on pallets. Yes I do. Um, I've got the longer one on the bottom and then, then two shorter ones. Um, I've kind of pulled it forward a little bit. Um, and I'm putting the spigot on this side. I pulled it forward just a little bit. I don't think that, that it's going to be a problem. Um, I don't know. Maybe it is. We'll see. But I wanted to be able to reach that spigot really easily. So now all I've got to do is set it up over here just like I do over here. I don't know if I'm going to be able to accomplish this today. 
I am sweating. I mean, it, it's just like it's all over my eyes, all over my glasses. Maybe I'll just take a break and uh, if I get a second wind, I can set up this water catchment system even though we're not going to have rain for, I don't know, over two weeks. I don't know. I can always pray for rain though. It's hot outside, but the clouds have come in. And I've heard some rumbling, so you know what? I'm tired. I'm hot. I got to get this done. Crap, it's raining. It's almost up. Let me get this done. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Um, I don't even have a proper bungee. <laughs> but this is what I've done. <laughs> okay, it's going in. It'll work for now. It's just rolled up and stuck down in there. There's plenty, plenty down in there. Look at this. Janky! But it's the best I can do in like about two minutes. This one's collecting like gangbusters. Oh my gosh. Okay, I need to open this up. Oh yeah, that's going in a lot better. Okay, that's open. Uh, it's just going to fill this up. I don't think it'll be able to pull it out. Um, it, it's not the way it's supposed to be, but I don't care. I'm getting water. Oh, oh, oh praise the Lord. And you know what's really funny? Is I had just watered almost all of my plants, so that's okay. They're going to get watered even better now. You know what? God really does provide. Look at just in time. It was like starting to rain when I was putting it up. I can't believe it. Oh, my gosh. Yes. I'm getting water. Oh, and look at that pond. It, the pond was almost, there were just a couple inches of water left in it, and it is almost full now. I think I may just stand out here and take a shower. I don't know. I think my neighbors would have something to say about that. <laughs> yep, I did it. I took a shower out in the rain. I kept this on, you know, and just washed them in me. That was awesome. Oh, Sandy, here, beauty's out. Let me show her to you. There she is. She don't care about the rain. She's getting all wet. I wish she would do some walking for you because she's walking almost 100%. In fact, she's been doing so good, I had considered putting her back with the flock. Whoops. Raindrop just hit it and zoomed in. See, look at her. She scratches. She jumps up on that thing. Sorry if it's foggy. My camera is kind of fogged up. See that? Look at that. She wants out to go see the other chickens. <laughs> I got a shower. I'm getting water. My plants are watered. It has cooled down. It was like 90 degrees inside the tiny house. I didn't turn on the air conditioner. I just turned off the, the baby chicks heat map. Oh my gosh. What a blessing today is. This is so cool. Anyhow, um, you know what? I'm going to go dry off. So... That's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.